I've run out of tracks, so what better excuse than this to try it out? Stupid slimes bothering me, let's go. This law will also be good. Oh shit, <laughs> it didn't work that well. Seems like I have to have enough clearing above for this to work. This will also test if I need any powered rails or stuff like that, which I probably do. Let's see if I can fit now. Wee! Oh, this is the best ride ever, and it even destroys slimes. Very good. No trouble with the needing power so far. I <laughs> can just speed on through. Yay! <laughs> then I have the bouncy thing. Maybe I should get rid of that or change it into a stopper. <laughs> What's up, Bambi? You're partying? Come on, get out of the way. Damn it, I can't. Oh, there we go. Although I, I still can't see if it's a stopper or a normal track. Come on, Bambi. Move. Yes, it is a stopper. So now I need more rails. Oh, looks like I got a demonite banner on the way while fighting fighting off uh, demon eyes and zombies at the night. And, um, let's put it in here where I also have the crab banner. And then another thing that I got on the way is boreal wood. They changed that the changed it so that that the blah 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 so that the trees in the snowy biome give off boreal wood. So that's another room for me to build because you can build all the usual furniture with this stuff. Let's put it in here for now. Although I'm low on normal wood, damn it. Mm. No, I can easily like farm farm that by. Destroying something like a living wood or these trees over here, so I'm probably gonna do that. And I should still have plenty of uh, lead here for for the rails. It's like uh, one bar gives you one bar plus one uh, wood gives you gives you thirty. So maybe I actually won't need any uh, any more wood at least for now because <laughs> this will give me. 76 times 30, so that's quite a lot. I had like 540 and I got up to uh, there. Let's see, another 540 would probably take me to like here, and then another 540. Oh god, it's gonna be so much. Maybe I should do this after all, at least not now, it'll take forever. Hmm. Maybe I'll build it up to here, because this looks like another place to fish for corrupt goldfish or something.
Alright, that's enough of uh, minecart construction for now. It looks like I can even go over the uh, meteor right there without getting uh, set on fire and crush lines like that. But although the bad thing about these is that you can't uh, like shoot anything or even swing the weapons. Can't even build here. Or, well, you can, but then the minecart disappears. Anyway, enough of that, let's head out to sea to find the Angela. And here we are at the edge of the ocean. I don't see him, at least uh, not anywhere on the sand. Uh, but he could also be, apparently, I think, uh, like floating on the water. But I don't see him. Could he be all the way? Oh, shit. Uh, how do I? There we go. Hide that map. Could he be all the way? At the edge of the damn uh, ocean, but I can't really get there that easily. Damn it, where are you, Mr. Angler? Oh no, could it be that I need to have a freaking uh, world that's generated after 1.2.4? That would really suck. Because I don't have. Well, actually. Hmm, I don't remember what. When did I make the. Uh, a whole new world where I went to get that crimson and other stuff. Certainly I do not see him over here. Oh, wait a minute, there he is, there he is. Uh, sleeping angler. I'm coming for ya. Hold on buddy, hold on. I just need my spinny thing and rocket boots. There we go. You saved me, you're awful nice. Well, I don't think you weren't much... Uh, Apparently we were just floating there and the sharks weren't minding about you anyway. You're awful nice, I could use your, uh, I mean, totally hire you <laughs> to do some awesome stuff for me. He gives you questuses. I love collecting those bright yellow stars that fall from the sky. I love it when, I love it even more when they land on someone's head. <laughs> but, but nothing beats a star that falls in a forest, foresty lake and turns into a fish. That's just totally red, and you're just red enough to get it for me. Hmm. So I need a fallen starfish. I wonder when those spawn. He said foresty. <laughs> He's falling into the ocean now. He did say foresty lake, so maybe it needs to be in a normal biome. Of course, I could just look it up on the wake. Hey, they have a list of all the fish and where you have to catch them. And it's probably like a... Oh, that's a, that's a mighty tree that I want to fall. It's probably in a normal biome and at night. Or possibly even when a star falls. Or when it falls into a lake. That's quite specific though. Anyway, let's get some of these and find me a foresty lake. And then I probably have to wait until nightfall. Can't resist trying out the flesh catch flesh catcher, even though it's still daytime. Uh, see if there's a oh here's a nice spot right here. Throw it in there and give me something good. Give me some good. Come on, bobber. Let me see. Oh, there it is. Yes. Oh, come on, a freaking tin can. Are you kidding me? It's garbage. Oh, I forgot to mention the other new wood type, which is palm wood. So I came back here to plant some seeds so palms could grow in the ocean slash beach biome here. And I could eventually come, come on, plant it, come back here to chop them down and build me some furniture in a room out of this new palm wood. Oh, there's an ant lion down there. I wanna get it. Can I reach it? Yes, I can. Get those vultures too. Come on, give me an antler, please. They're so rare. No, he, he, he or she or it didn't give me one, you stingy bastards. Let's plant some of these anyway. And then head back home because a traveling merchant also arrived again. It's, I think he has like a chance to arrive every day, so. Every time a new day dawns, he might arrive. And I also caught some bash, but nothing worth mentioning in a seaweed. 
another uh, trash item. These don't even have any worth, so I can't do anything ex with them except uh, store the job where or something. Where's my mirror? There it is. Let's gaze upon it and greet the merchant again. Mm, where is he this time? Over there. <coughs> Let's see what you got, what's your name? Gallius! <laughs> Reminds me of a game where there's a unit called Flying Gallius. Because that unit also always says Flying Gallius when you select it. Hmm, Saki, another Japanese thing, consumable. And there's the Panther and the Fez again, damn it. It's only two new things a water gun and uh, the Saki. Mm, I guess I should get both. Do, 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 do. Screw some people with it. Uh, I wonder if it uh, requires any ammo. Nope. <laughs> You're all wet now. Sucks to be you. Pew pew pew. <laughs> He's all glistening with water. <clears throat> Too bad I can't shoot myself with this because I think you get like a debuff called wet that doesn't really do anything except tell you that you're wet. Although it is probably good against uh, invisible enemies if there are any. Hey party girl, it's party, it's a water fight, you're all wet now, haha. <laughs> Speaking of the party girl, maybe I should try some fireworks from her. Already tried the confetti gun last time. And there's a bubble one too. Hmm. What's the difference between a box and a fountain. I don't know, let's buy both. They're pretty expensive though. I don't have enough money. I might have some in the in the piggy bank though. No, oh crap. <laughs> Even after selling all those damn uh, glow sticks and jellyfish things, apparently I wasted all my money. This thing was probably like 10 gold or something. Do, 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 do. Oh, it was only one and a half gold. <laughs> Where'd all my money go then? It's not like I die or anything. Oh well, let's go test the fountain. Have a midnight party, even though it's not midnight. <laughs> but it kind of looks like midnight over there near the mushroom bottom. Here we go. Pew! Yay! Pew, pew, pew. Where's my water gun? Word up in the air, pew pew pew. <laughs> it's a party over here, it's a party over there. Come on, Terrell, it's party. You're all right now. What the hell are you doing down here anyway? Oh, yeah, I can use it multiple times. That's awesome. So it's not a one time thing like the confetti gun. Pew 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 pew. Or did I put it out using this? No, it's still, it's still going. It's still going. Hmm. Anyway, now I should look for more places to fish. I could try in the ocean, because I read that uh, once you have a area or a volume of water that's over 200 or was it 300 blocks, then you have... There's like zero chance to get junk, like tin cans and whatnot. But then again, that's pretty far. So maybe I should try and build the fishing place somewhere closer, although that would mean a lot of trips with water buckets from like down there or here, or I could try the water pumps, uh, but I don't remember how long of a reach they have, maybe I should wiki that. Alright, the maximum distance for the pumps to pump liquids is a thousand blocks, so I could probably get it from there to here. But then again, there also might be more water, like, right below here, beneath the house, where I'm eventually gonna build the elevator down to hell. Uh, but to make that easier, I should try and make a uh, mining potion, which is a new one. But unfortunately, you need a uh, antlion mandible for that, so I was thinking of going around the map to all the various deserts on this side. There's pretty much that one only to uh, look for more antlion things and also plant more palm trees but first it's time to drop the base <laughs> and i caught it myself actually i shouldn't have come come down here because i should have put it to here where i put all the other uh, fishing stuff or rewards mostly 
And I moved the angler guy here because he probably likes to live in a bathtub. <laughs> um, so now let's head uh, that way to the desert. Uh, although I should, uh, yeah, I need more, uh, more, whatchamacallit, the uh, damn acorns. Here we go, first desert. Uh, no antlions anywhere, damn it. Where are you? They're, so, they're like one of the rarest enemies anyway, so this might take a while. Let's uh, at least plant these. They should be able to grow here, even though this isn't an ocean biome. But as long as it's uh, an acorn planted on sand, it should work. Become a palm tree. Let's see if any of them have grown over here. Yes sir, we got one. One palm tree, yeah, it's not worth it to go over there yet, <laughs> just for one palm tree. One more than that. Huh, here's a nice little lake, maybe I should try fishing here for something special. A corrupt fish, perhaps. Although these assholes are gonna bother me and I can't, like, stand down there, because if you're inside any uh, liquid yourself, it won't work. I guess I gotta try to dodge him. Keep an eye on the bobber too. Ooh, a neon tetra. Hmm, it doesn't say anything about being material like the bass was. So this could be a reward. I mean, uh, not reward, but requirement for some quest. <laughs> Let's try again. Come on, yes, there we go. Oh god, another tetra, damn it. I don't want multiples unless they're good for something which these aren't. Mm, let's try one more time. Things are good. Move that bobber before they arrive. Come on. There we go. Seaweed. Oh, come on. This isn't even big enough. Mm, oh, yeah, it stops there, so it's not big enough. It contains the junk. Let's move on to the next desert or uh, fishing hole. Here's the next desert, so let's start planting. Hmm, I wonder if uh, antlions are more uh, keen to spawn at daytime or nighttime. Probably daytime, because I don't remember ever seeing them at nighttime. Yeah, there's like a freaking flying eye there, so. So, uh, antlions probably don't even spawn at night time. Come on, I just need one antlion mandible from you. And I've reached the edge. So, might as well plant some of these here as well. Oh god, except there's not really any room. Uh, I don't know if it works on the uh, ebon sand here. Oh, it does. <laughs> well, that generator palm that gives you uh, palm wood or corrupt wood or corrupt palm wood <laughs> if such a thing exists probably not and now that I'm here might as well try some fishing on the big water itself cast away oh shit that was actually a bad idea I can't see the bobber in the darkness over there try to cast it closer give me something big there we go. Oh, come on. What the hell? I, I pulled it in, but I got nothing. Come on, quickly before they arrive. Oh, what the fuck? Was I too late again? Yeah, it sucks. I'm just build myself a shelter of some kind. I don't have any usable blocks, though. Actually, cactus can be placed, so let's use that. Might as well have plenty of it. Come on, get out of here. Ooh, ancient... Oh, it's a... Wait a minute, shadow scam. I don't have that yet. I have ancient cobalt stuff and... Uh, ancient... Uh, was it iron stuff? Yeah, I think so. And that's an addition to my collection. There we go, now I'm shielded from all the enemies from the right side. Let's cast off. Actually, that's probably a shipping term, not a fishing term. There we go. Ooh, a trout. And that's also material, so you can probably make a hooked fish out of it, just like the bash. 
Nothing. And I lost my bait. I only have 15. I caught some worms by, uh, uh, like, if you destroy grass or uh, background rocks or dirt or rock walls, then there's a small chance that... Oh, come on. Stupid soul eaters. There's a small chance that a worm will come out and then you can use the bug net to catch it. But I caught, a, caught an uh, ebon koi. Interesting. Uh, but that means I, this doesn't count as a notion. Oh, come on. Ocean by my, I was scratching myself so I could pull it in. This doesn't count as ocean biome, it counts as a freaking corrupt biome. Mm -hmm.